The SoundWeb London Room Combine is a dedicated processing object. It reduces programming time, allows graphical representation of rooms, deals with dynamic linking of parameters, and allows the combining and uncombining of auto mixers. The following demonstration shows the functionality of the SoundWeb London Room Combine processing object. Double clicking on the object brings up the default control panel. It's split into two tabs, room controls and room combining. Rooms are added to groups by selecting a group and clicking on the rooms to add them to the selected group. Faders, mutes and source selectors are now linked in accordance with room groups. As rooms are combined and uncombined, the linking of controls changes dynamically. The room combined processing object is located in Mixer's Gains. To begin configuring rooms, click the button next to Configure Rooms in Properties. Rooms can be deleted, added and organised graphically in this window. In this example we have a large room surrounded by six small rooms and another large room to the side. The Room Combined Processing object can support up to 24 background music sources. In this example, we'll use 8. Double clicking on the Room Combined Processing object shows that the default control panel has scaled with our requirements. The Room Combining tab shows our rooms as we organised them earlier. Since we now have eight rooms, we now have four possible groups. The default names of the rooms can be edited to describe the physical spaces. To add partitions, simply double click on a room and single click on the adjoining room. Repeat this for all adjoining rooms. Having added room names and partitions, we can now go back to the default control panel and see how it is updated to reflect the changes. The partitions can now be clicked. This automatically places the rooms into groups. Rooms without partitions can be placed into groups by selecting a group and clicking on the rooms to be added as we did earlier. The grouping can be seen on the room controls page and again the faders, mutes and source selectors are linked in accordance with room groups. Room partitions can be triggered from contact closures by dragging the partition from the room combining tab on the default control panel and dropping it onto the appropriate control input within the design tree.
Room combining can also be controlled from a blue ten. A blue ten is added in the usual way. Here the button positions are being resized. Again the partition is dragged from the room combining tab on the default control panel and dropped onto the blue ten button position. The blue ten simulation can be used to verify the operation of the partition button from the blue ten. The room combined processing object has a comprehensive set of properties. Use AutoMixer IO adds extra nodes to allow AutoMixers within rooms to be combined and uncombined in accordance with room groups. Enable Stereo adds the extra nodes associated to a stereo object. Choosing No for Mix BGM signal path splits outputs into source and BGM, allowing, for example, different EQs on each output type. Use signal names allows meaningful entries in the background music drop-down lists. Here sources with signal names are being wired up to the BGM inputs. Note how the BGM input drop-down lists now contain the signal names of the sources we just wired up. Again, the source selectors are linked in accordance with room groups. Group colors can also be customized in properties. Priority partition mode is a special mode of the room combined processing object. Here a new room combined processing object is being added with the priority partition mode property set to yes. Note the four groups. In this mode, each room has a default group number. The rooms are organized paying particular attention to the default group numbers. Here they are organized in the order 1, 4, 3, 2 from left to right. Partitions are added in the same way as before. In order to demonstrate the priority, in this example the faders are set up diagonally downwards from left to right or 1 to 4. When rooms 4 and 3 are combined, 3 takes priority. When room 2 is added in, 2 takes priority. When room 1 is added in, 1 takes priority. Again, the controls are linked in accordance with room groups. Further information can be found at bssaudio.com.